Hey, it's Gus. And Luke. Um, we are going to show you how to get the All in the Cards Achievement 1 in uh, Final Fantasy IX. So uh, you can get this achievement at pretty much any point in the game, but this is the earliest you can get it. And also, it's a little advantageous because uh, you can get some really strong cards here. So the first thing you want to do, this is the first town you enter, is go straight up. And there's a little hippo boy. You need to talk to him, and he's going to be like, Oh, I hid my card somewhere. And you need to find this church tower, go up the ladder, and he hid his cards up here for some reason. Yeah, I think he just lost them. Yeah. He was a little confused. And he was trying to play it off all cool. Um, there's three cards up here. Um, they aren't particularly strong, I don't think. I think it's like a skeleton, a flan, and Ring a in the bells. beast. Yeah. Hit him in a belt. What a fucking why, why, idiot. How did he lose him in the bell? How did he hide him in, an, in the bell? That's, that's a devious. Um, yeah, so those three cards that I said were not the three cards you get. Uh, I think the Ironetta card is actually pretty good. Other than that, they're kind of garbage. Um, so once you get those, uh, you can climb back down. And uh, out here, there's a little boy on the dock. It took me a really long time to find, so I talked to these two guys because they look like the Hey, kids we're kids too on this yeah. boat. <laughs> um, yeah, no, see, I saw him, and then I was like, no, this old guy down here he looks, looks just way like more a, like, like a statue kid. hanging out of there. <laughs> so go talk to the kid. He's going to be like, oh, I, I lost my cat. Can you find my cat for me? We're going we're gonna to find the cards in the cat this time <laughs> now? <laughs> no, you're not. But you say yes, and his cat is at the very beginning. Actually, it's, it's before the beginning because you actually don't see the area that the cat is in you come from it so go back the way you came keep going south just keep going run past all these dumb kids yep keep going and uh one more well, and right kids. when you walk in you see the cat you just go up you punch the cat and the little boy comes along he's like that's my cat Meow. so what you need to do uh he won't give you the cards you need to go back to the docks and talk to him and he'll give you the card but i'm not going to show you that because there are hidden cards here that we need to get so you can either go talk to him and come back or stay here and get the cards. You can't see any of the chests that they're in because that's Final Fantasy IX's favorite wow. thing to do is hide chests where you can't see That them. was a sneaky one in yeah. the corner. So there's one in the corner. There's one up in this doorway. And there's the sneakiest one, which is... Is it behind the statue? It's behind the statue far wall. As far as you can go. I need to think about it for a second. There we go. Oh, wow. Wait to look for the exclamation point right there. Um, there's a few more hidden cards. Uh just along the way um, i don't think there's any in this area i think it's the next um place also you get cards for doing the jump roping um i think you get one at 50 and one at 100 the one you get at 100 is the genji card i think it's one of the strongest cards in the game you saw genji what? yeah yeah no oh. overwatch there's a crossover the it exists in the same universe and the last hidden card is in this bar um, it's in that barrel. It's a flank card. Flank cards suck. But you need at least five cards in order to start a, a duel game with someone. And uh, I and you can challenge pretty much anyone uh, in this area. Um, and they're all they all have really weak cards, which it, again that's why it's advantageous. Um, I have no idea where I got that cactar card. That might be the <laughs> iron card that I was talking about earlier. Maybe that's a really up. strong one. Uh, Genji's that top one. He has like a million hit points. And uh, I got that castle one from doing the jump rope thing, too. So, um, Yeah, but that's it. Once you beat your first person in a Duel Monsters card game, you uh, you get the uh, the achievement. And I think it's 40 points. Easy peasy. Yeah. Um, have you ever played Final Fantasy IX before? You know, I've, I'm thinking about it. This video's got me intrigued now. Yeah, you think? Well, I, I think I might be a card master. 40 easy <laughs> gamer score. I have no idea. It's 15 gamer score, by the way. I have no idea how to play this game. It, like, it's complete rubbish.